this is me a curly haired girl with the aim of getting a fabulous haircut <laughs> yes her forehead may be big but at least she doesn't look like this or this or this now, I've wanted to do this for ages, but the appointment get, uh, for my hairdressing job kept on getting pushed back. So I finally decided to do it myself. <laughs> what a good idea. Um, so here you see me already having cut one half of my hair because I got kind of impatient. And I was like, hey, wait a second. I actually wanted to film this. So I was like, okay, well, I'll just get the camera then. <laughs> I say camera. No, it's an iPad. Um, so as you can see, it looks raggedy and crusty. As if I've lived in a cave for 15 years and emerged with fleas, this hair, and appreciation, and no appreciation for the degree that hairdressers work years for. So, um, considering most of my Barbies looked like this, I actually have no idea why I thought I was qualified enough to even hold scissors, which, by the way, are nailed scissors because that my grandma gave me, um, because, well, there was really no thought process, um, so there's that. As you can see, I'm putting in the utmost concentration into what will soon be a Dora the Explorer haircut. If I'm being honest, actually, that's kind of what I was going for. You know, Dora the Explorer chic. Um, though it kind of turned out to be more like a B-Tech half black Wednesday Adams, so that also didn't work out. Uh, the only thing I'm actually grateful for is probably... The fact that I'm actually not going to school for the next month. Actually, <laughs> I lie. I actually kind of low-key think it's cool now. Well, yeah, when I say low-key, I mean the key is pretty low, like hell low. But, but it's still there, if you know what I mean, you know? As you can see, I'm having a great time, you know, fixing my dastardly hair. And I don't know why I put it in a bun and then took the fringe out, but... You know, things don't go well here in, in this house. Well, this house, this mind. It was the night before. And everything started to go wrong, as you can see. Um, so, basically, um, I straightened my hair. And then I cut it again without, like, like I thought, I don't know what I was thinking, but I, I cut it whilst it was straightened, and I was like, oh, it's not that, it's not like that straightened, you know, um, for some reason. Um, so now my hair looks like this. Um, <laughs> I didn't, I didn't realise until I washed it. Um, this is what it looks like, and it's really uneven as well. It's really uneven. Before I cut it even more, I looked like, you know, the seal wig. But, but, I followed other people's advice. And they told me to cut, yes, it was partially my fault because I cut it while straightened. But it's also their fault because they told me to. So, really, I don't think I'm at fault here. Though, I do look like this now, so... <laughs> You know, I, I low-key, I low-key vibe with it, but also, I don't, you know, this is literally what my exact fear was. Like, this is what I was exactly not going for. But, um, I guess, uh, I guess that's how life is. We end up looking like the, uh, like the old... <laughs> I looked at myself and I just, I remembered what's his name from Despicable Me, the guy in orange, the evil man-child in orange, that's what I'm think. I look, this is what my life has come to, oh well, <laughs> let me just straighten it on camera, because so, I think it, that's why I'm not completely freaking out, because I can always just straighten it every single day so my hair is crusty okay well that's actually looking worse now yikes oh it's crunchy 
crispy. Is that okay? No, it's not. Look at it. You know, and you kind of just want to even it out. But at the same time, I'm scared that I'm going to make it worse. So, you know, I don't want it to end up even worse than it is now. <laughs> okay, that's not too bad, actually. That should be fine, right? No. <laughs> that's not okay. <laughs> that's not allowed. I should have just listened to my space. This is what happens when you don't listen to yourself and you listen to other people. It was all their fault. And this is where I am right now. This is where I am. Whatever. I'm over it. <laughs> um, update. <laughs> so, I'm actually... It's actually a little better now that it's dried a bit more. It looks a bit, you know, kind of 80s. Um, still not that great, but a little better. 